<laughs> oh, you Minecraft crew. Oh, I love you. You are so funny. But, uh, oh, thanks, Lizzie. But, uh, today is uh, going to be something a little bit different from my channel. Today, we're not going to have any tractor videos. Today, we're going to be examining the contents of this box. <clears throat> so, this box that I ordered, oh, three days select, roughly a week and a half ago, just arrived today. And we're going to be dissecting it and taking a look at its contents. Opening it up with my Yoshi Blade ceramic knife. Ooh. Slides through plastic tape like butter. Here we go. Just stab myself in the stomach with the Yoshi Blade. Alright. First we have the packing slip from the International Food Shop, which is essentially what this is. So I've been uh, hanging out and playing games with the Minecraft crew for quite some time, and as any of you on my channel, any of you from the Minecraft crew fan base know, about you know half of the Minecraft crew is from the UK. And so I get to hear them talk about the interesting food stuffs that they have over there, and we compare food. But I decided that I would give this uh, mail order food place a shot and give, you know, a try to some of these really, really interesting foods that they have. So um, let's take a look at some of these little packages that we have. We have <coughs> baked wapsits. Cheesy baked watsits. It's interesting. Put that up there. Cheesy baked watsits. We have walkers, cheese and onion. These certainly look like our standard. Oh, well, these really did get crushed. Um, look like Lay's potato chips, but these are cheese and onion. Right here. We have what I've heard is some people's favorite. Walker potato chips. These are the prawn cocktail. And since they are so many people's favorite, I got a couple of them. They might be good. I don't know. Uh, prawn flavored potato chips don't really seem to seem like they would be delicious. But, uh, you know, whatever. We've got sherbet lemon. Which, uh, Seem to be some sort of more snacky food of some kind. Oh, sherbet lemon. Um, another packet of Walker's cheese and onion. Uh, original hula hoops. Um, I don't. Those are like potato rings. Uh, got a couple different types of. Angel Delight, which is, I guess you add it to milk, and it's some kind of fluffy milk thing, drink of some kind. So we got strawberry, and just because one of my favorite people in the world, Piper Bunny, has said that uh, it's too sweet, I got the butterscotch as well, because nothing is too sweet for me. And of course, Jaffa Cakes. Now, here we have um, something that we can get that are supposedly kind of like Jaffa Cakes. And I'll grab a packet of it here and put it on top. These are Lou's Pims with orange. And I've been really kind of interested to see how they stack up to the immortal Jaffa cake. Um, made famous amongst my friends and I by Lewis and Simon of the Ozcast, mostly by Simon. Uh, so let's go ahead and look at the 
four packets of Jaffa cakes that I've bought. It's a Jaffa Mountain. Um, some of the rest of this isn't going to be all that interesting, I don't think. Um, they are in better packaging that uh, might make it a little difficult to open now. But uh, this one I grabbed because uh, another one of my favorite people of all time, the Gizmo Dude from the crew, has said it was his favorite drink. Um, this is the original Lucozade. We don't actually have this here. He said it was kind of like Gatorade, but I did some reading on it and doesn't seem to be remotely like Gatorade. Let me just set that down over here. I don't ever seem to have enough to drink, so I have no idea what could possibly be in this one. Um, it's like it's like thermal pack. Um, ah. Okay, so these are the smallish candies that were that I was told I needed to try. We have Cadbury's Curly Whirly, which we don't have here. As far as I know, I've never seen them. Um, we've got two of those because they're wicked cheap. We've got a twirl, which apparently is good to eat while watching Doctor Who. Uh, which is good because I recently developed an obsession with that show. White Maltesers, I think. Is how you say that? I don't know. But they're white chocolate. They're, uh, I guess, kind of like Whoppers, which we have here. But, you know, white chocolate. This is something called Flake. It's a four pack. No idea what that is. Um, it's apparently the crumbliest, flakiest milk chocolate. And we'll go ahead and put that right there. Another twirl because I have roughly four episodes of Doctor Who to catch up on. I figured well, when I first ordered this, I had two seasons to catch up, but you know, whatever. White Maltesers again. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. Apparently, I bought four of those. You can't really go wrong with uh, white chocolate and whatnot. Now, this doesn't even remotely seem like it would be good. Um, I have no idea what it is. It looks like uh, looks like one flavor of Smarties, um, but they're called Parma Violets. Um, I don't know, I think, uh, I think Piper recommended that one. Um, not entirely sure. Not, I don't have a whole lot of high hopes for that. It, uh, looks kind of, oh. Um, let's see. So there's two more things in here, so. Obviously this is HP sauce. I've had this a lot at the uh, the uh, horse press pub that's not too far away, and Daddy's also at the horse press. I already know that I like those. Um, it looks like there's nothing else in there. That's uh, that's it. I think I got one more thing of that's that's Lucas Aid. That's Cherry Lucozade, it's a larger one. Um, and there's my Mound O foreign food that, uh, well, 
could be good, could be bad. I have no idea. I'm going to try and be objective about them. And if they're bad, I will yell at uh, Piper and Gizmo because they made every single one of the suggestions aside from the HP and Daddies, which I already knew that I liked, and the Jaffa Cakes, which I knew I was going to get anyway. Uh, so, anyone that uh, stuck with me throughout this video, thank you. Make sure you are checking out the Hill software um, every day for new Minecraft crew videos. Check back on this channel for uh, more interesting uh, little uh, videos from Blake when he puts them out. Uh, he hasn't done one in a while. He's been a little busy. But uh, he's he's got some ideas, and he'll be doing what he can to get one to you uh, as soon as possible. Probably, it's probably going to be another week or two, but, uh, but he'll get you one. And he's got an idea, actually, for an entire series. So be sure you check that out if you have any interest in... Uh, in let's say lesser played niche games that uh, I wouldn't be caught dead playing, but Blake seems to like them. So anyway, um, check out the Hill software. It's uh, the Minecraft Cruise channel. Uh, also, check out the uh, back here for more stuff. You can uh, follow me on Twitter at wildwolf503. If you'd like, that's where I post all my, uh, sort of, if I'm going to live stream something, that's where it goes to first. I don't generally live stream very much, but that's where it gets posted at. There's also the Wild Wolf, uh, Justin TV. Uh, that's where the live streams usually are, if there are any. Uh, I've got a plan for one, uh, in the next couple of weeks. That should be moderately interesting, hopefully. But uh, this video is getting long and drawn out, all for looking at snack food. Um, I hope you enjoy it, because um, I may or may not. Uh, if you don't hear from me in a couple of days, it means that I uh, was killed by prawn-flavored chips. Uh, bye!